The Lord be with you. Welcome to Daily Prayer from Faith Lutheran Church, Columbus, Indiana. Today is September 14th, which is Holy Cross Day. We will be following the order of responsive prayer 1 from Lutheran Service Book, page 282. Holy God, Holy and Most Gracious Father, have mercy and hear us. I cry to you, O Lord. In the morning my prayer comes before you. Restore to me the joy of your salvation, and uphold me with a willing spirit. My mouth is filled with your praise, and with your glory all the day. Every day I will praise you, and praise your name forever and ever. By awesome deeds you answer us with righteousness. O God of our salvation, the hope of all the ends of the earth, and of the farthest sea, bless the Lord, O my soul, and all that is within me bless his holy name. He, he redeems your life from the pit and crowns you with steadfast love and mercy. Hear my prayer, O Lord. Let my cry come to you. A reading from Psalm 31. Blessed be the Lord, for he has wondrously shown his steadfast love to me. When I was in a besieged city, I said, I had said in my alarm, I am cut off from your sight. But you heard the voice of my pleas for mercy when I cried to you for help. Love the Lord, all you his saints. The Lord preserves the faithful, but abundantly repays the one who acts in pride. Be strong and let your heart take courage, all you who wait for the Lord. A reading from Mark chapter 12. And you shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. The devotional reading for today is from Portals of Prayer for Monday, September 14th. And he and Jesus said to all, If anyone would come after me, let him deny himself and take up his cross daily, and follow me. Luke chapter 9. Love the Lord with your whole mind. Intentionality. That is a word I've often used when speaking at churches and relating how to share the gospel. Intentionality gives clarity and focus to evangelism, something that is sorely needed today. We are not robots moving around by a set of written codes. We are free moral agents who make choices, good ones and bad. The Lord urges us to follow him, and that takes intentionality. We choose to do right over wrong, to deny ourselves rather than vaunt ourselves over others. We are redeemed people who face the world, the flesh, and the devil in our daily walk. Because of sin, we will fall short. But by God's amazing grace, we live daily in forgiveness of sin. The enemy of our souls seeks to enlarge guilt and fear, accusing us of not being able to fulfill the commands of God. As followers of Christ, we have good news. Jesus Christ died for us and gave us his marvelous gift of salvation. Because he fully kept the law, we who are saved are in Christ and new creations. We are set free from sin slavery. Now we strive daily to grow in our intentionality to love the Lord, denying ourselves and taking up our crosses. Lord, help me to follow you fully. Amen. Merciful God, your Son, Jesus Christ, was lifted high upon the cross that he might bear the sins of the world and draw all people to himself. Grant that we who glory in his death for our redemption may faithfully heed his call to bear the cross and follow him who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God, now and forever. Amen. I thank you, my Heavenly Father, through Jesus Christ, your dear Son, that you have kept me this night from all harm and danger. And I pray that you would keep me this day also from sin and every evil, that all my doings in life may please you. For into your hands I commend myself, my body and soul and all things. Let your holy angel be with me, that the evil foe may have no power over me. Amen. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. The Lord bless us, defend us from all evil, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. We will be streaming for daily prayer again tomorrow morning at 7 a.m. The Lord bless your day.